Hello then, welcome to Linux Studio, and this video is about Super Test Cart. So, if you have never heard about this game, then you are probably living in a dungeon. I mean, this is the most popular game on Linux. I mean, everyone knows about this game, and they have played at least once because this game is amazing. It's it's very cool, and if you play with your friends over a server, then it makes things really really awesome. So they recently released their 1.2 addition and it has a bunch of new features so these are the features that it offers for the latest version but the problem is that if you try to go to the official website and download the archive file from there it will download the older version that is 1.1 here and if you try to extract it then this will provide you again 1.1 and the source code for the application and you have to execute this shell in order to start the game and if you are someone who knows about it then you can easily create a desktop entry so that you can easily start the game but uh, this is not the more efficient way to get the application up and running so this is out of the list so i'm going to close this one the other option that you get is through the dot dev file or through the snapcraft or flatpak so if you go to the flatpak website they are again providing you the 1.1 addition even the ads is not giving you 1.2 which was built on 20th July. So it's not the updated version. And again, you can install using the Snapcraft. And uh, if you do not know anything about the Snap, then I have a video on that. Just watch it and you will learn everything that is there about the Snap applications. Then the, the other option that you have is throw a package file for your particular distribution. For example, if you are using Fedora, Manzaro or Red Hat, then you can download the .rpm file. And again, it's not the latest addition yet it is 1.1.1 and uh, for the ubuntu as well it's 1.1 however they have a repo here and it is providing you 1.2 so if you add this repo set in the system you can download the 1.2 version of the game and you can install it so it is providing you 1.2 addition so you can easily download this tab file from here and install it if you do not want to add the repo set of course but if you want to add the repo then it becomes cheesy and uh, just to let you know on the software center it does not provide the latest version it is only providing you 1.1 so to install the application through the repo you just have to open the terminal so here is my terminal and uh, just add the repo directory. so to add the repo you have to type sudo because we are making some changes in the root directory particularly in the sources.list file and there we have to add a repository for that particular game and to add a repository you have to type add then hyphen apt then repository and after that you have to specify the name of the repo so for that you have to type ppa personal private archive i think then the repo name you have to type the name exactly so for that you have to type stk super test card then deb developer edition hit enter type in the password and uh, this will add the repo in the system this will again ask you that you are going to add the repo here and uh, you can hit enter and this should start updating the repo links in the system and if it doesn't do something like this then you have to execute another command that is sudo apt update and it will do just the same but nowadays it does it automatically when you add a repository in the system so after that you can simply clear the terminal if you want then you can install the application so to install it you have to type sudo apt typical stuff and the application name in this case it's a game so you can type super tux card and hit enter and this is going to download around 606 megabytes and uh, after the installation it will consume around 700 megabyte and it will install the application so you can type this command but i have enabled the aliases in my system so i can easily type india here and then the super tux card and this will do just the same thing and this is i'm able to do because i have added a alias for this particular command here and if you want to know more about how to short your command so that you can do stuff on the terminal fast you can watch this video about aliases and you will be able to do that exactly so i can simply now hit enter and this will start to download the files that are required and uh, let me just fast forward the video
so it has done downloading and installing the game in the system so now i can simply minimize this window from here and search for super test card in my system so here's the game and this should start the game so now you get these different options here if you want to play online you can play online and you can also like uh, play the story mode and single player so i'm going to select here the single player and uh, this is saying you can choose your character so let's go with this one here and uh, let me say intermediate and uh, let's go now so this is starting now and now i can simply play the game and here is the support test card up and running in my system so this way you can install the latest version of the game in the system and uh, play it the way you want i hope you find this video helpful if you did then do not forget to subscribe to the channel i'll catch you in the next one till then take care and keep enjoying linux